Pensacola Senior Programs have something for everyone. Aerobics, bingo, volleyball, cookouts, and congregate meals are just a sampling of what is offered. Joining me now to share information about the city's senior programs is Kim Carmody. Kim, thanks for being here. Thanks for having me. Well, y'all are very busy, so we appreciate mm -hmm. you making time to be here. And you uh, have all kinds of programs and classes, uh, of course. And uh, before we get into the more senior programs, let's talk about just the vast array of programs that the city really offers um, residents. Oh, we got oodles and oodles. Um, we've got six community centers and they offer a variety of activities. Our newest one is our Sanders Beach Kareem Jones. It's over very, nice um, facility. very sweet. Uh, they do building rentals, they have art classes, uh, after school programs, day camp programs, uh, outdoor adventure programs, um, and then the other community centers, they also offer those as well, mm -hmm. um, but they don't have that big old social hall that, uh, that of course, mm -hmm. the Sanders Beach Kareem Jones does. Mm -hmm. But um, our biggest programs that we are gearing up for right now is our summer camp program. Um, that will be this summer. Uh, it starts at the end of school and goes all the way through the summertime. Uh, fun activities for kids uh, and parents because, you know, the parents get to drop them off and, and either go to work or have fun and play. Right. Um, but that is a 10-hour day of field trips, swimming, arts and crafts, games, and just uh, good friends as well. Okay. So that's that's offered at all of the centers. All of the centers. Uh -huh. Okay. Well, let's talk about the senior programs because a lot of seniors are maybe looking for something to do. Mm -hmm. We know that socialization is just mm -hmm. as important as nutrition mm -hmm. and everything mm -hmm. else. So tell us uh, what they can come and actually participate mm -hmm. in. Um, and the Senior Center, it's not just, we do senior activities at the Senior Center, but several of our other centers also have okay. senior type of activities. Great. So I'm going to kind of just kind of give you an overview of what we do at the Senior Center and then also at our different locations. Perfect. Um, we're kind of the hub at Bayview Senior Center. Um, we're, you know, all the programs kind of feed out from there. Um, it's absolutely free to walk in the door and, and join our activities. We don't charge anything. There's no membership fee. You come in and you have a good time. Now, once you get there, you have multiple choices to make. Um, you kind of go to the, the front desk and you got to figure out what you want to do that day. Um, is it to go into the library and read a good book? Um, to get into the computer lab and surf the net and email your friends? Join a bridge group? Uh, play hand and foot? Do bingo? congregate meals, dancing, arts and crafts. So we have about eight or nine different rooms that, and there's activities going on from about eight o'clock in the morning until about eight o'clock at night. Um, just a wide variety of activities. Um, and that's just at the Senior Center. Um, if you go over to Cobb or Fricker or Sanders Beach, Corrine Jones or Gold Point, we even expand our programs. Um, mm -hmm. They're doing arts and crafts as well. Um, most of those programs run from nine to one. They do a congregate meal site as well at those sites. Um, our and crafts, like I said, bingo. They do some traveling. Some of them get to go play at the casinos. They, okay. they get a bus and charter it. Shopping trips, field trips. It's kind of like, I want to say day camp for seniors. Um, mm -hmm. They have a great time and most of those programs are free as well. Well, thank you for mm -hmm. mentioning the Congregate Meal Sites and we mm -hmm. appreciate y'all's partnership mm -hmm. in allowing us to, to offer mm -hmm. that uh, to the seniors in the community. Now, some of these things that you mentioned seem to be kind of ongoing, mm -hmm. but then there are other also classes that are for a set period of time or a set mm -hmm. number of weeks, say a mm -hmm. photography, for example. Just exactly. We do a ceramics program at three of our sites that run for a month, and they learn different uh, methods with the kiln and uh, firing and uh, whatever it does with ceramics. We also do chair yoga classes. Those will start next week on Tuesdays. Those are free. Those will be offered at the Bayview Senior Center. Um, they run for a month and if there's a, a great participation then we continue the program. All of our classes are going to be based on participation numbers. Mm -hmm. um, we do Tai Chi. Uh, now we do have a huge following in Tai Chi. It's a wonderful program that is offered at our Sanders Beach Corrine Jones and then also at our Bayview Community Centers as well. Well, what kind of feedback do you get from the participants? You know, do they enjoy getting, you know, getting out and being around other people? Or what do they say to you? Oh, my gosh, they're wonderful. Um, they love coming in. We have a lot of uh, regulars that come in, and usually they end up bringing their friends and family members. Um, they like being there. They like socialization. They especially like our fitness classes and our dances. We have about three or four dances a month, um, Friday nights and then Saturday nights. Um, they come in, they dress up, and they have a wonderful time, whether it's the ballroom dance, Dancing or the line dancing or um, swing, they come in and they do it all. So they're having a fabulous time doing it. Well, great. Mm -hmm. Well, why do you feel it's so important that the city, uh, as a, as the city of Pensacola, offer this and support these seniors? Um, well, they need recreation too. Uh, but uh, it is fitness is key. I, I think fitness because we do offer a lot of fitness programs, and fitness is not just the body, but also the mind and the sure, spirit. Sure. Um, it keeps you healthy. Mm -hmm. It lowers your uh, a lot of your health issues like diabetes, obesity, heart problems. 
problems. Um, socialization, it gets you out in the public. You're not staying at home, just kind of doing absolutely nothing. Um, a lot of our seniors that come in, um, they actually will create programs for us as well. Um, you know, we may not know there's an interest in knitting. And as soon as someone comes in, they say, oh, we want to learn to knit. You know, we, we have a class, and usually they fill up pretty quick. Mm -hmm. um, but it, it's extremely key that we, we take care of our seniors and we, we keep them active and, and alive and viable. Um, and a lot of our seniors that come into the program also volunteer. So we're not just providing services for mm -hmm. them. They're providing services to us. So somebody may have an area of expertise, mm -hmm. and they'll say, I'll be willing to teach that knitting class, exactly. for example. And they won't just teach it at the senior center. They'll actually go teach it to children. We have a, 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 a young lady who is teaching Chinese. She is from uh, China. And so she wanted to introduce her culture, and mm -hmm. she started at the senior center as a senior, and now she's introducing it at several of our other community centers. Well, great. Well, it sounds like there's just tons going on. How can people find out so they're not missing out? Uh, is there a phone number they can call? Mm -hmm. I know you also have a new website also. We Tell do. us a little bit about that. Uh, the phone number we, you can reach us at is 436-5190. That is to the Senior Center. Our website is really, really easy. It's www.playpensacola.com. And it is it is sounds just like it's spelled, P-L-A-Y-P-E-N-S-A-C-O-L-A. -E -E so it's very, very easy. And you just click on Senior Programs, and it lists everything the city has. Um, it will also, which is coming up, is our senior games, which will be in oh, September. Great, great. We will start registration for senior games, and you can get that information on our website as well. So if you play bocce ball, you chess player, uh, frisbee golf, um, anything, mm -hmm. we uh, it will be a senior game, and we are a qualifying event, which will be in September. Yeah, that, that's a great event. Oh, yeah, it's awesome. Well, uh, I know there's some other qualifying mm -hmm. things for that one, but just the general programs. Um, who's who's eligible? Do you have to be a certain mm -hmm. age? You have to be a resident? Kind of. You have to be can come? fifty and older. Okay. Um, we do ask that you establish a residency. We we don't get a different charge. You're either county resident or a city resident. But uh, no, you just have to be fifty and older, and we do ID. All right. <laughs> <laughs> we have some younger uh, seniors that want to try to, to come in because they are great services that we provide. Well, great. Mm -hmm. Well, thank you very much mm -hmm. for all that you do for the mm -hmm. seniors and for working with us on mm -hmm. the congregate meals. And it's just a great group of, of things to do great. and get people out. So we Perfect. appreciate it. Thank, thank you. you so much.